again, to think that, you know, that you weren't looking out for yourself to, to advance somewhere else at another university. You were willing to stay there, stick it out, and, and, and no matter what the outcome was going to be. And, that, and as, a father, I, as a father, I can't tell you how much that actually meant to me for you to stay there at, at, at Penn State. I mean, it's different. You know, you go to you go to a school like Penn State, you accept a responsibility. You're you're a different person. You're cut from a different cloth. And I feel like, you know, since the moment I walked in at Penn State, that was a place for me. And there was nothing was going to happen that was going to make me leave that place or make me want to go somewhere else. You know, and I had to deal with different types of things from my whole career there, from my freshman year to my my fifth year as a senior. And uh, you know, it's it, it's made me. Uh, a better person, a better man because of it, but you know, without you and mom and you know, support of Paul and John as well, I, I wouldn't be able to get it done. And you know, you really find out the type of person you are and that you really find out the type of people that you, know, you surround yourself with, with uh, you know, when, when time gets tough. And you know, it, uh, man, it was, it was a special journey and you know, couldn't be more proud to you know, be more fortunate or blessed to have you, know, you and mom as parents and have Paul and John as brothers and you know, have the support of, of Scranton. That's one of the biggest compliments, Matt, I, I, you've got. I, mean, I don't even know if me and mom ever told you. We went down to Penn State for a game maybe two years after everything happened at Penn State. And I was walking up, and of course, I still wear the Penn State shirt from McGloin on. You know, I'm so proud of it. And we, we were walking up the steps at halftime. And, and there was a gentleman at the top of the steps and he stopped me and he goes, are you related to Matt McGloin? I said, it's my son. And he goes, you see those kids on that field playing? I said, yeah, he goes, they're playing because what your kid did in 2012.